The Ethan Project was something that was developed in a partnership between the fire department and the health department, um, something that came out of Dr. Purse's um, ideas of what he wanted to do for the city of Houston, though with the overall goal being to reduce the number of, of non-emergent 911 calls and also um, the, the number of transports going to the um, ER that weren't necessary. Project Ethan, or Emergency Telehealth and Navigation, has two physicians located in this room who are simultaneously talking with crews, patients all over the city to try and safely and efficiently handle these low acuity calls. So we're making about a thousand calls for service a day. About 84% of those are related to emergency medical service calls. A crew in the field can respond to a patient for any reason, um, and once they've determined that the patient may have a lower acuity call, they can activate Ethan. Based off of our assessment that we do on the patient, our initial assessment, uh, we determine whether the patient will be a candidate for transport, non-transport, or an Ethan case. The fact that the Panasonic G1 fulfilled all of our needs dispatch, documentation, and gave us Ethan capability was a, really a win-win solution that we were not counting on, but we're very fortunate to stumble across. The G1 device that we ended up selecting allowed um, all of our crews to essentially carry a single unit. But having the tough pad to be able to do this is basically giving these patients uh, what they need, and not just an emergency room, but clinic care and care that they can receive quicker than if they were to go say in an ambulance transport. So in looking at the requirements to support the Ethan video capturing, we determined that the 4G LTE connectivity was important. A reliable, fast connection is crucial for this project to be a success. Myself, along with our network team, tested the coverage areas to make sure that they felt comfortable with the City of Houston overall at 4G LTE coverage. The Verizon was a great partner, both in working with as well as a demonstrated best coverage. We're able to receive a call whether we're out in the middle of a field or inside the unit itself because of the connectivity that we've got. If you don't have a good connection, being able to see the patient, see their responses, it's not just their answers, but it's how they look, you know, how, what, what level of pain they're having, where they're pointing when they show you the pain. I mean, the technology is the key to making it all work. Panasonic was instrumental in helping us expedite both the um, ordering of the devices, and also delivery uh, image management. So now, using TuffPad technology, we have the option of offering a patient a clinic visit, or when we find that they're non-emergent and really don't need an ambulance to go to the hospital, perhaps they can take an alternative source of transport to the hospital. Uh, never before did I ever think that we would be able to do a video conference with a doctor um, it, while we're in the field and make a decision based off of our assessment and the doctor's assessment to determine what is best for a patient at that time. And devices like the Tough Pad have made that possible. The fire department and the EMS division within the city of Houston are great partners, right? And it's been a, an honor to work with them. But really what we've done is demonstrate that we can be using healthcare and particularly pairing new, relatively new technology in an innovative way to de deliver not only better healthcare, but more efficient healthcare.